Hello everyone. Now I am going to solve a doubt which is asked by Nachiketa from Mumbai, India. So question is in a solution containing 0.01 m HCl and 0.1 m H2 Cesare, ratio of H plus produced from a strong acid and weak acid respectively is x is to 1 report your answer as x by 500 given k1 of h2 series is this and k2 of h2 series is 4 into inverse 11 so before going to solve this question you have to identify the key point of given question which will give the direction to solve the question so, what is the key point here? This question is based on mixture of a stronger acid and weak polyprotic acid. The dissociation of weak polyprotic acid is suppressed by a stronger acid. Therefore, H plus can be calculated by taking the H plus from a stronger acid only. So key point is for the given question, key point is H plus concentration of H plus total will be H plus from a stronger acid only in given quotient from SCL only which is equal to 0 0.01 molar in the presence of a stronger acid the degree of dissociation of Weak polyprotein is very very small. Now, question is you have to find the ratio of H plus coming from a stronger acid and from weaker acid. To solve this, you have to go for first dissociation reaction of weak acid. No need to write the second dissociation constraint because alpha 1 is very very less therefore alpha 2 will be very 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 less so no need to write the second dissociation equation now since SCL is a stronger acid it will dissociate 100% and it will give H plus aqueous Cl minus aqueous and when it will dissociate that is T completion the value of H plus will be 0 0.01 molar and the Cl minus is 0 0.01 molar because the coefficient ratio is 1 is to 1. Now for weak acid H2CO3 aqueous dissociates as H plus and HCO3 minus aqueous and aqueous. So initially at T initially the concentration of H2CO3 is 0.1 molar and this is from the a stronger acid that is 0 0.1 0 1 m this will be 0 at T equilibrium some moles of acid will dissociate. 
so you have to write 0 0.1 minus moles of acid dissociate so if we are going to write in terms of degree of dissociation so degree of dissociation is defined as moles dissociated divided by initial moles so moles dissociated will be equal to degree of dissociation into initial moles we are taking alpha as a degree of dissociation so this value will be 0 0.1 alpha this will be 0 0.01 plus if this of moles is dissociated then 0 0.1 alpha will be formed here and the value of this will be 0 0.1 alpha but according to the key point the total concentration will be the only from the strong acid it means 0 0.01 only from here in the presence of H plus the dissolution of acid will be suppressed so alpha is the very very less therefore 0 0.1 alpha is neglected with respect to 0 0.001 and we can write as approximately 0 0.01 since alpha is very very small we can also write this term as approximately 0 0.1 so from the dissociation constant of given acid K1 K, let us assume K1 is the dissociation constant of if an acid which is equal to concentration of H plus into concentration of H CO3 minus divided by concentration of H2 CO3. You know the concentration of H plus, you know the concentration of H2CO3. So, concentration of HCO3 minus will be. So, concentration of HCO3 minus will be equal to K1 into concentration of H2CO3 divide by concentration of H plus so put the value you will get K equal to 4 into 10 to the power minus 7 into concentration of H2CO3 will be from here it will be 0 0.1 and the concentration of H plus will be 0 0.01 which will be so we can solve this which will be equal to 4 into 10 to the power minus 6 molar concentration of H plus coming from H2CO3 will be equal to the concentration of HCO3 minus from here you can see here H plus coming from this will be 0 0.01 alpha which is equal to 0 0.01 alpha so both are the same we can use 42 10 to the power minus 6 now concentration of H plus from a stronger acid divided by concentration of H plus from weaker acid H2CO3 will be equal to 0 0.5 0 1 divided by 4 into 10 to the power minus 6 which will be equal to 1 by 4 into 
10 to the power of 4 which will be equal to 100 by 4 into 100 that is 2500 now our answer is she assume as x so our answer is x divided by 500 which will equal to 2500 divided by 500 that is equal to 5 now if you have to find out the component of CO3 2 minus so how you calculate you have to go for the second dissociation like HCO4 CO3 minus is going to dissociate H plus and CO3 2 minus you have to use the second dissociation constant and you know this value from here you also know the H plus from the stronger acid so you can calculate the constant of CO3 according to this equation K2 equal to concentration of H plus into concentration of CO3 2 minus divided by concentration of H CO3 minus so concentration of CO3 2 minus will be K2 into concentration of HCO3 minus divide by concentration of H plus which will be equal to K2 is the value of K2 is from here 4 into 10 minus 11 4 into 10 minus 11 into HCO3 is from here 4 into 10 to the power minus 6 so which is h plus is 0 0.01 so we know the value of this will be 16 into 10 to the power minus 15 molar thank you for watching my video and all the best for your examination.